The first case of cholera in Changwari refugee settlement was reported on 15 February after about five children were brought to the health facility with acute water diarrhea. According to earlier reports, an unidentified old man had died soon after arriving on the shores of Lake Arubat from the Democratic Republic of Congo. When he got up with this diarrhea, immediately when they had rushed to offer some kind of first aid, he died off. That was the first case to be noticed. Then at uh, Maltat, where we are settling them normally from the reception center, we, deli we deliver them to Maltatu, that's where we are locating them and give them, giving them clothes. Then some cases also came up. Although the cause of the outbreak could not be immediately ascertained, the authorities confirmed a cholera outbreak four days later. The doctors who were handled in such cases made an alarm of what had uh, come up and we were able to spread the gospel to the district health officer and we were advised to take up some tests to, make, to get a confirmation. And it was from that that uh, I think after three, four days, the confirmation has come back that it is true, it's a cholera outbreak. Cholera treatment centers have been set up at Kasonga and Wenyawawa, where the sick have been confined to prevent the spread of the contagious disease. So it started on 12th, but uh, so far we have seen uh, there was a peak by 15th of February. And uh, still we are receiving more patients uh, from uh, Maratatu settlement and also from uh, the reception center. Despite such interventions, the cholera spread first among the asylum seekers at Kagoma reception center and Maratatu settlement camp. Here in Maratatu camp, we have been informed that there are so far 20,000 refugees that have been settled here. And officials confirmed that most cholera cases have been reported in this camp. Medical workers here blame the outbreak on inadequate safe water sources in the new settlement. Currently, the water, the liter per person, is really inadequate. We have around only uh, six liters per person at the reception center. Majority of the new arrivals are mainly women, children, and old women from the Bagegere and Hema tribes of Eastern Congo. They are victims of intense ethnic violence in the eastern part of the Democratic Republic of Congo. It has been a, a tribal clash that has been uh, escalated by fighting over land and fishing grounds between the Lendu, the Hema and the Bakigelu, and a few Alus who have also come in. Other than cholera, the refugees also reported cases of acute respiratory diseases and injuries sustained as they escaped the violence. Sam Poza, NTV in Changwali.